the dramedy from the minds of Mindy Kaling and Lang Fisher is riding high on the Netflix chart globally, alongside The Sandman, Virgin River, and Stranger Things. Never Have I Ever follows the misadventures of high school student Devi as she grapples with the grief of losing her father while navigating the pitfalls of adolescence including sex and romance. At the heart of Never Have I Ever is the love triangle between Devi, stereotypical nerd Ben and archetypal jock Paxton Hall Yoshida, Darren Barnett, which has had several twists and turns over the past three seasons and continues to keep fans on their toes about who the team will choose. Reflecting on whether Devi does love Ben, Lewison, 21, simply said, yeah, I think he does. On whether Devi reciprocated his affections, he said, yeah, I think she loves him too. But I think they each have a long way to go. I think love occurs on a spectrum and they've been building this foundation of their friendship and the foundation of their romance. However, Team Ben fans shouldn't rejoice just yet and assume Devi and Ben are now endgame with the actor going on to say, I also think that Devi does love Paxton, too, and I do think she's learning to love herself. So I think for her to fully be with anybody, whether it's Ben or Paxton or Day or somebody else, she has a long way to go. He said his co-star Ramakrishnan was a big proponent of Team Devi and oftentimes has said Devi needs to learn self-love before she can be with anyone, something which season 3 alluded to when therapist Dr. Jenny Ryan, Nisi Nash, pointed out having a boyfriend hadn't magically solved all the teen's problems. Additionally, Paxton ended his brief romance with Devi because she was constantly second-guessing herself and why a popular jock would stoop low in the high school pecking order to date her. Lewison said, I've gotten the privilege to hear her talk about it and I think she's right. He said Ben was guilty of not loving himself too, warning a lack of self-love caused things to implode between Devi and him the first time as they both self-sabotaged. Season 3's final scene saw Devi deciding she was ready to lose her virginity and paid a visit to Ben after he jokingly gave her a pass for one free boy. Lewison said there had been several different setups with he and Ramakrishnan doing a number of versions of the closing scene, which has left fans on tenterhooks about whether Ben and Devi sealed the deal with a kiss. Sadly. For fans, the star wouldn't be drawn on whether the characters had locked lips in one of those unused aches. Season 4 of Never Have I Ever will be the last one and got the green light while the cast were working on the third outing, leading both outings to be filmed consecutively as the writer's room thrashed out a suitable ending to Dovey's story. Although Lewison is bound by strict Netflix secrecy, he did tease it was the best season that we've ever done both in terms of the character arcs and show as a whole. Never Have I Ever first debuted in April 2020 during the height of the COVID-19 pandemic with cast having to do a virtual premiere in lockdown, however, they finally got their big screening this year. Lewison said, that was one if not, the best day of my life just because we worked so hard and the reception has been incredible for seasons 1 and 2. But you don't quite get the scope of that when it's not in person. Numbers online are amazing but it's hard to quantify that in your own head and then feel the energy and feel the physical presence of everybody at the premiere was just so, so special. Lewison even brought his family and friends along to the premiere to celebrate with him. The actor said he was still trying to process the last week and a half. Dot prior to playing Ben Gross Never Have I Ever, Lewison was a child actor and started out in the business at the tender age of five with a recurring role in Barney and Friends, later getting bit parts in the TV series Lone Star, TV movie Bad Fairy, the Adam Sandler film Men, Women, and Children, and Tag. 
However, the Netflix series is his most high-profile part to date and has sent his star status soaring. Along with starring in all four seasons of Never Have I Ever, Lewison was also a full-time student at the University of Southern California, impressively balancing his coursework with his filming commitments. Lewison graduated this year with a degree in psychology just as he wrapped up on the Netflix show, admitting it was a strange feeling having both of them finishing at the same time, for most of my adult life, they were intertwined. He said, now, it's about what comes next, whether it's going to be a thriller or a comedy. I'm not quite sure but I'm excited about what the future holds for me and future projects. I hope it will be something that means as much to people as Never Have I Ever does. Never Have I Ever Season 3 is streaming on Netflix now, 